Hi, this is Mike O'Connor, Realtor O'Connor at AOL.com, 951-847-4883. I'm in front of 2125 Saddleback Drive in Corona. This is a HUD-owned listing. List price is 272. It's a four bedroom, two and three quarter bath, 1,862 square foot house on a 4,700 square foot lot. Let me give you a little view of the area. This is in the Hidden Valley area of uh, Corona. It's on uh, adjacent to Riverside. And as you can see, it's a gently uh, sloping area, um, nicer community with um, 1988 construction. Coming up to the front of the house, you can see there's a lot of uh, little deferred things that need to be done. The lawn's quite dead. The shrubs are overgrown. That's not unusual for a HUD home. HUD only sells as is. And um, what they really look at are um, the competitiveness of the bids as far as pricing. As you come into the house, there's a very big landing here and volume ceiling area. And directly to the right is the uh, formal living room. The house does need some work. I would recommend that probably all the flooring needs to be done as well as paint and maybe some fixtures. This is the uh, formal dining room area. As you can see, it has a slider that goes out to a covered patio area. A lot of nice natural light there. Coming through from the dining room, you come into the kitchen, which is also open to the family room. There's a lot of light here with a lot of windows at the back. It does have a double oven and a lot of cupboard space here. This is the family room. It does have a fireplace. There's access point out from this room as well into the backyard. As you can see, it's got wood fencing. It's got the covered patio. It also has a balcony on this side up uh, where the uh, master bedroom is. There's a side utility area on this side. So what we'll do is come and bring you through the rest of the house. We do have a bedroom on the lower level and it's heading back this way. You can see here is the front door, the volume area, the staircase that comes down. And right over here is the downstairs bedroom. This is a double door entry into this bedroom. It's a little bit dark because of overgrown shrubbery outside. Coming down this hall, you come to the three-quarter bath. So it has a shower stall at the end. Coming in here, this is the entry to the garage. This is where the laundry area goes. It is a two-car garage. It's finished all around. And there's a door out to the side area through there. So coming back, what we'll do is we'll go upstairs. As you can see, there is ceramic tile. It's very much a 1988 style. It's also a wood insert here, but definitely needs a little bit of work on the trim. And as I said, carpet needs to be replaced throughout. But coming up right at the top of the stairs is bedroom number two. And this is at the front of the house. You can see it's got a good size closet does need a rod and shelf in that closet. There's a linen area here that's right adjacent to the bathroom. This is the main hall bathroom. Ceramic tile floor in this room. Bedroom number three, kind of the middle bedroom here. And then at the back of the house is the master bedroom. As I said earlier, this room actually has a lot of light because it has the uh, door and the patio on the back, corner windows, and it has its own full bath. It has two closets, uh, one here. It's not as small as it kind of looks because there's a divider in there and some shelving, and then a walk-in closet on this side. Coming back, you have the vanity. You have a single shower tub combination, but it is large oval size and then a small toilet room over here. So again, my name is Mike O'Connor, Realtor O'Connor at AOL.com, 951-847-4883. Please let me know if you're interested in putting in a bid on this great HUD-owned property.